Hi guys, we're back on WAB 9 News at 9 and the Baton Rouge Music Studio <laughs> <laughs> is hosting <laughs> their <laughs> I love it when Doug comes. Mm. Uh, hopefully there's spring jam session this Saturday. Local bands, food. It'll be a, at the brand new place, your brand new uh, facility that you were telling us about last time. Right. Actually, so the facility is still, still in there. the is works, it? but yeah. we built a, an outside patio stage. We're calling it the underdog stage for our underdog spirit. And uh, it's ready to go. It's beautiful. And uh, we're going to have 11 bands out there all day. Uh, we actually got so big that we had to add a stage, so uh, we're, we're using the entire uh, premises, you know, the, prim uh, the whole, the whole uh, property. Area, property. Thank you. Well, Doug Gay is the founder of the Baton Rouge Music Studio, and for people that are not familiar, it's on government. Tell us where it's at. It's right across the street from Mid-City Beer Garden right. at Steel and Government, 380 3809 Government Street. And like I say, we're gonna we're gonna use the whole property. Uh, we'll have uh, food by Chow Yum, and uh, I'm a Catholic school fair kid, so we gotta have drinks for the adults. So we'll have beer and mixed drinks for the adults. Uh, Italian ices and MJ's Cafe is gonna be doing some vegan cookies. What? It's gonna be fun, and man. This is gonna be this Saturday. This Saturday, we'll have about 70 students perform on on this on a smaller stage. Uh, we're calling it the market stage. So we'll have an arts market with vendors out there. And then on the main stage, the underdog stage, we'll have uh, six of our young bands, four local bands, and Joven Webb, who uh, was season 18, number seven, on American Idol, will be headlining from five to six that night to close out the I'll night. I'll be darn. Yeah, it's gonna uh, be fun. Did you ever think that this thing would take off like this when you started yeah. it? I know you hoped. But Small it's growing every time you come. It's a long journey of ups and downs, you know. But I can tell you that this this is uh, this is where I want to be, and I've always hoped we could uh, we could be where we are now. So we're growing, we're maxing out, we're looking at where we can expand, and we're we're just making a difference in kids' lives. You know, for me, if someone goes on tour, that's a feather in the cap. But if someone makes a, a friend that they want to go spend the night with on Friday and jam, that's where the magic is for us. More about community than music lessons. Well, you sent me the, the uh, Alex oh, yeah, Abel. Yeah. Alex Abel, I don't know yeah. if y'all got Giving that him or a shout not, out. he was a, a former student, right? He was, yeah. And, and now, now he's got he, a new album that just dropped? Yep, just released a new single uh, called Birthday. Check him out, Alex Abel Music on YouTube and Instagram. Uh, and he is killing it right now. He's doing great. He just moved back to town from Nashville. Wow. And uh, he's setting up shop here and uh, making some music, man. Former student going big. Yeah. What is the instrument most taught at I'd say it's a tie between piano and guitar. Uh, we are building our voice program. We have a phenomenal teacher, JC Guidry, who's uh, started just started a vocal explorers class and she's uh, teaching private lessons there. So we're really getting that vocal thing happening because for the bands, we need, we need singers, right? So, you know, we're building all of our little uh, drums, wow. guitar, piano, we bass, you know. Well, you talked about the outdoor studio. What, uh, what is the, uh, I mean, the outdoor pavilion. What, what's, what's next? I mean, you, 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 you're always thinking. Yeah, so uh, we're still working on our venue. Uh, we want to have a community space where, uh, you know, musicians who, who are amateurs who just need a place to, to play and bring their friends out, we'll have that there. A in the spirit of community, I want to have, you know, ping pong tables and things like that where the kids can just hang out and jam and, you know, so it'll be a venue but also a hangout. That is so awesome. Doug, yeah. congratulations. You keep, it, keep it up, Doug. Doug Gay had, uh, had, uh, meet it this Saturday at, what is it, 11? March 23rd, 11 a.m. to 6, 6 p.m. Government Street. It's my mom's birthday. Happy 81st, Mother. What a great note to end on. <laughs> <laughs> we'll be right back.